Hey YouTube, Camper Van Kevin here. Well today I'm back in Cornelia, Georgia, up at my buddy's car lot, and I have sold the Uplander Chevy van. Fantastic van, great van. I just wasn't using it. Uh, it was set for six months, so I decided to let it go. No regrets in owning it, but got to move forward. So I'm going to take the tag off, and uh, I've already done the deal here. Well, there she goes. Good little van. I want to show you guys this uh, little Geo Tracker that my buddy got in. This is hilarious. What do you think about that, May Mays? Are you laughing too? Now listen, here's the thing. I don't believe in making fun of anybody's RV. I don't believe in making fun of anybody's car, or truck, what they drive. I don't care if you drive or ride a bicycle. But seeing how this is not anybody's um, geo tracker, <laughs> you guys got to see this. I come up here to sell uh, to get my payment for my uh, Chevy Uplander, and this little geo tracker was sitting on the lot. I had told my buddy to be looking for me one, and he said they're kind of scarce. But, uh, you know, I've showed you art trucks before out of Athens. I, I believe we got a contender here. I believe it's a contender. So, uh, let me show it to you. What you guys doing? What are you guys doing? Oh, heaven forbid, Martini. It's a, it's a camera. You monkeys. You monkeys. Now, everybody knows my tracker. She's uh she's completely stock except for the hard top roof, two piece hard top roof, and of course now the lift kit that's under here from uh, low range off road. So this is what stock looks like. This is not stock. Um, you know, usually, I, usually, I'm not at a loss for words. I'm pretty good at running my mouth. Um, I used to do paint and body work, and I've put on a quite fair amount of uh, body molding. Um, it's on the wheels. It's on the wheels, too. Are you kidding me? They put body molding on the wheels. Let's just start. Let's just start at the beginning. You ready? I believe this is a spoon. Boom. Um, it's on the wheel. Two thousand dollars, six hundred down. I think it's got one hundred and eighty thousand miles on it. it. Does have the five speed? Kind of wish I had the five speed. Wait, I missed it earlier. It's got it all over the wheel, the outside of the wheel. Yeah, it's got body molding on the wheels. Looks like he did a good job as uh, keeping it balanced, I guess. Are you kidding me? Yeah, the, the blue's a nice touch, right? He even did the soft top. My word. Now again, I'm not making fun of anybody. Are you kidding me? This this belongs to nobody, so uh I don't know what this is. What is this? I don't oh that's that uh it's like a push push bar keeps from hitting the gas tank.
must be $300 worth of molding on here. So if anybody wants me to do this to the tracker, just, uh, just let me know in the comments below. Uh, I'll make sure I take it into consideration. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We're not done. Was that Billy Zane? What do you say? Wait a minute, and there's more. Yes, the inside is done as well. What I'm talking about. I wish I had that five speed sometimes. Let's sit down in here and and just uh, take all this in. Uh, oh, that's mine. I'm sitting here. I'm not looking through the viewfinder. I'm, I'm kind of amazed. Um, I guess you'll never will find me quite speechless, but I'm about as close as I'm going to get. Ooh. Felix needs to be here so he can do his Vanna White. Let's do that again, Van White. She and there's more. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah, buddy. Oh, did not forget the back. No, sir. Hope you guys are enjoying this. Yeah. I'm kind of tempted to see if he put it under the hood, too. I mean, right? Hey, air conditioning, that's a nice. Well, the hood's up. Looks like they did miss doing it under the hood. Oh, wish I had a little air conditioning compressor. That's all right. Yeah, buddy. Let's do a pan of this. You ready? Here we go. Okay, you know, again, like I said, I'm not into making fun of people's vehicles, but this really doesn't belong to anybody. Even the guy that owns the car lot here, he's laughing about it. So, just sharing it with my, uh, just sharing it with my YouTube family and friends. Chuck, are you laughing? You are, aren't you? I don't think the Wolfpack would ride with me if I had that one. Not for sure what I'm going to do here in uh, the North Georgia mountains while I'm here. I may go ride some dirt roads. I may, I've got my fishing pole with me. I may go see if I can uh, catch a trout or two. Or I might just turn around and go home. But uh, shoot, this tracker was worth the trip to get here. Well, it looks like we're gonna we're in uh, Clarksville, Georgia, right now. Look at that gas, dollar ninety nine a gallon for regular. Oh yeah. So, I used to live in Cornelia, Clarksville, Demarest, Helen area up here. We're one mile from Clarksville, one uh, eighteen from Helen. I'm going to ride up here by the trade school on Highway 197 and see if there's anybody up there at the trout stream. Pretty little town. We're into downtown Clarksville now. I used to go up here to North Georgia Technical College. And uh, straight ahead, you bear hard right, like you're heading 441 North. Little deli called Quick Turn Deli. I worked there for a couple of years. I can toss a pizza. If I can toss pizza dough to the ceiling and catch it. That's been a long time ago though. Tucker, you doing alright, buddy? Yeah, right here on this corner. This is Goodwill donation now. I flipped a mini a pizza in there.
North Georgia Technical College, Moccasin Creek State Park. Also heads to Lake Burton. 441 North. This is the old 441 North. Tallulah Gorge is in front of us. This used to be our quarter mile race strip right here. From here to across the bridge where that Jeep sat, we used to race. Time ourselves anyway. So, how I'm not dead, I don't know. George Calvin Jackson Bridge on 197. You guys want to go fishing? Uh -huh. Lady said that they caught some small ones and some big ones up here and let them go. Now, Georgia's a beautiful place, but nothing much like North Georgia. Never know what you're gonna see on the Camper Van Kevin show, right? Now I've caught a mini a trout right here. Tuck. Beautiful. What is this? I believe it's called, I believe it's the Soak. Soku, Soak. But all the fish are down there, so I gotta try to work my way. I just can't get over that log real well. Yeah. You're gonna have fun no matter what, right, Tuck? Oh, hell, go play. You're not sitting with me. I'm just saying. Well, there goes my fishing. I sure do miss my teeth cam. I'm going to have to buy another. I'm gonna have to buy another GoPro. Cause I can't hold this and do like I did with the GoPro. If I catch something, I'll let you guys know. Tuck. There's that fool. She's wanting to fish. That he's having fun. I moved a little bit further down. Tucker, you're gonna put a hurting on my trout fishing today. You don't care. You just wear yourself out. Swimming fool. He's a little better at swimming. Well, no look fishing. I believe Tucker spooked my fish. That's okay. They need to have a good time too. May May. Ooh, what a handful. It's like trying to herd ducks today. It's a good looking tracker. Even if it is mine.
Now we've gone up uh, 197 toward Lake Burton for several miles. And we're at a place called Mark of the Potter. What it is, it's kind of like a community place where they make their own clay pottery and fire it here. And they sell their wares. They've been here for many, many years. Um, I'm not into pottery so much. I kind of appreciate what they're, they're doing. But in this river here, let's pan back around. Here we go. <laughs> tuck, tuck. You nut. You nut. Is this river and these falls. They've got an observation deck right over here. We're going to go and get a little bit closer. But there's something I want to show you down here in this pool. Born. They uh, opened up the day I was born. They opened up the year I was born, rather. I used to buy and sell a good bit of Coca-Cola stuff. Never had one this small. My roll is larger. And that sucker's working. Ooh. Any cheer wine? Got a Yoo-Hoo. Mm. Let's go inside. So let's go inside. Beautiful. I'm not a very good tourist guide. I kind of like to show people what I like to see. Not necessarily what everybody want, else wants to see. So you guys have to suffer through what I like. see is outside. Hello. Hi, how are y'all? Good. So here's where they make a lot of their dishes and plates and bowls. And they have a kiln out back that they fire everything. This is what I come for. You know me and waterfalls, right? But here's the thing. Uh, they've got pet trout. I'm gonna zoom down here everybody to see look at there monsters all out in there as well this is the first time I've never seen food out here You guys see them? I had no idea I'd be making this video today. 
I've thought about coming up here before. Look at that. How bad does that make you want to go fishing? Of course, people try to come in here and fish, but it's, Ill it's illegal or not allowed or whatever. No fishing. Notice to poachers. Rivers know this. Let's see here. Rivers know this. There is no hurry. We shall get there someday. Pooh? Winnie the Pooh? I feel like I'm bouncing all over the place today. It happens when I'm trying to show you guys too much at once. I've got the zoom on as well. I just saw the fish food behind me. Let's have some fun. Okay, everybody, here we go. Look at the monsters. Look at the monster fish, monster trout. Last handful. Goodness gracious. They know who butters their bread. You know, I don't know how to better end a camper van Kevin video. I had no idea that I'd make this video today. So I sold the Uplander. I went trout fishing. Tucker went swimming. You got you got to see Mark of the Potter. Some monster trout. Look at that waterfall. Look at that. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for watching my videos. You guys take care. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye. I love my life.